here in my garage. Just bought this uh, new Lamborghini here. Is this an ad? Drive up here. So click the link. Go there. It's completely free to watch it. It's just a couple minutes. Is this some kind of marketing scam on YouTube? They're promoting this crap? Let's just watch some television or something, dude. I'm, I'm done with YouTube right now. I'm done with the internet. In fact, what? I'm a lot more proud of these. Done the fucking television now? Dude, go fuck off, man. Take vacation with all your scammers. Stop harassing me, dude. Talk about Warren Buffett. Money, dude, I don't call it money. Scamming anymore. kids I call on it YouTube, fuel man. Units. You, you must have enough peace, fuel units. Dude. To live ah, out your dream and to live out your destiny. So I'll see you on my website. It's a quick video. Wow, Ethan, great moves. Keep it up. Proud of you. A lot of people have been asking me to talk about Mr. Here in My Garage. Okay, so we didn't want to do it. Felt like I didn't have anything to say about it, but you guys wanted it, so here, I'm gonna talk about Mr. Lamborghini here. This guy's been running his ads on YouTube like crazy, and it's turned into some phenomenon where everybody knows, here in my garage guy. Now be careful, he's charming, he's persuasive, and he wants your money. So you gotta fight your urges, don't give him your money, give us money. Give, give us money. No, don't, don't, keep your money. Keep your money, let's just watch the video. Here in my garage, just bought this uh, new Lamborghini here. Fun to drive up here in the Hollywood Hills. But you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Let's let's level up here before we move on. This is a storage space and you rented that Lamborghini. Let's just get that out of the way right now, okay guys? Let's just put that on the table. This is a storage space. Whose garage looks like that? It looks like he just fucking put it up, dude. He's got a whiteboard in his garage. Dude, come on. Come on. He rented he rented that Ferrari, okay? The house isn't his. You rented the fry. Let's move on. But you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Well, let's see. What is it? What is it that you love more than your Lamborghini in the Hollywood Hills? Knowledge. 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 Cool, dude. Knowledge. 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 In fact, I'm a lot more proud of these seven new bookshelves that I had to get installed to hold 2,000 new books that I bought. I'm a lot more proud of these 2,000 books I've never read. Knowledge. Now, maybe you've seen my TEDx talk where I talk about how I read a book a day. You know, I read a book a day not to show off. It's, again, about the knowledge. By the way, he's got a really interesting technique for reading books. And when he says he reads one book a day, well, let's just say we'll have to redefine the word read. Have someone else read it for you. Read book summaries. Again, it's not just about money. It's about the good life. Health, wealth, love, and happiness. Health, love, wealth, and happiness, and Ferraris, and in the Hollywood Hills, and books. It's about a lot of books, guys. You need bookshelves with books. You don't have to read them, again, once again. I'm proud most of all of these books I haven't read. I'm not promising you that tomorrow you're going to be able to go out and buy a Lamborghini. But what I am telling you is it can happen faster than you think if you know the proven steps. The proven steps. If you ever come across anyone selling anything with proven steps, you're being scammed. 21 proven steps to creating quality video to grow proven your business. Steps. 21 proven steps to creating quality video. If you're a cynic, if you're a pessimist, you don't need to click here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a rational human being that is skeptical of people of internet marketers trying to take your money, don't click here. This isn't for you. Let me weed you guys out, okay? I frankly don't have that much bandwidth on my website. That hosting is expensive, guys. So please don't bother to click the link. As saps, suckers, people who fall for this shit. Have you ever fallen for an internet scam? That's who I want. Optimists. Okay, guys? You guys, click. Everyone else, get the fuck out. Money, I don't call it money anymore. I call it fuel units. You must have enough fuel units to live out your dream and to live out your destiny. So I'll see you on my website. It's kind of obscene how every detail of this video is so purposeful. The Lamborghini, the garage, the bookshelf, the iPhone recording. This guy's kind of a, this guy's a sicko, dude. This guy's a sociopath. <laughs> and he wants your money so fucking bad, dude. He's thought about this video a lot. All right, welcome to this, uh, what I call lessons from a Lamborghini. I'm here with Jeremy. Oh, I don't really care about this car, Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I don't really care about material, Lamborghini. Lamborghini. I don't care about material possessions in my Hollywood Hills, Lamborghini. Lamborghini. Sure, Ty Lopez. Sure, you don't care about material possessions. Most of everything that people tell you is wrong. He 
loves it, dude. Jeremy doesn't look that interested, though. So far, Jeremy, he doesn't look that interested, I gotta say. 99% of adults feel like they failed. So they want to justify all the mistakes they made by saying, you know what? I had to make all these mistakes. What? What the fuck, dude? He's just like, peace, dog. This shit is going fucking too long, dude. I'm just going to put on my headphones. Peace out. Jeremy! You're here, dude. I love Jeremy. Ty, what the fuck is this video, dude? No. Look. People who right. do big things. People who right. do big things. People who right. do big things. Fuck, Jeremy's the real guru, dude. I love that. He says it like mid-sentence. Ty's not even finished with a sentence. Like, he can't make it more obvious that he's not listening. Mid-sentence just drops the right bomb, dude. See, is this an automatic? Is he driving a Lamborghini automatic? What's wrong with you, Ty? Do you want to drive a stick? You drive all these sports cars, you don't have to drive a stick. I think that's the most compelling evidence that this guy's full of shit. He owns all these sports cars, top of the line. Dude drives them automatic. Proven steps. They shoved me in the boot. Like how much more resistance can a fucking steak add to a sword cut?